This was um, actually a farmed field, and in 2011, when the developer closed on it, they started their infrastructure and sold the first developable lots in October of 2011. And you can see all the vertical that has gone on between single family homes, multifamily, apartments, and then there's also a commercial aspect to this. The agricultural land was probably worth anywhere from 7,500 to maybe 10, 12,000 an acre. And now today, if you can find uh, commercial land like this that has city services, infrastructure, sewer, water to it, you're going to be easily in the 40 to 50,000, somewhere 100,000 an acre. Now what we're looking at is the Harvest Hill subdivision. As I mentioned before, this was a field in 2011. And if you look over towards the east, that field there has just gone through its final recordation for its development. And it's going to have commercial and residential multifamily aspect to it as well. That'll be available next spring. Our typical four bedroom, three bath house is in the 330 range, 330,000. If you're going to rent a single family home, average is about $1,000 a bedroom. So if you're looking at a apartment complex, 26 to $2,700 to $3,300 for a two bedroom, two bath apartment. As far as you know, us having a boom bust scenario, this is an industry changing technology. I foresee that with the sustainable population of Williston being on a good day, 80 to 100,000, and we're only at less than 30,000 now, we have several years yet of sustainable stuff that we need to do to make Williston the thriving community that it needs to be. Mm -hmm.